Oh yeah, beautiful. Who could ask for more for a beautiful Thanksgiving dinner with the family? Perhaps it's a sign of things to come. It's raining sideways! It's getting tense, man. I don't know how much longer I can hang in here, Jess. You alright, babe? Oh. Uh. I think I'm getting fear. Uh. Grab your plate, let's go. Come on, Jess. No, oh, it's raining. Just get out of here. All right. Sean. Sean. Wake up, wake up, shine. What are you doing out here in the middle of a lake? Well, you were driving all night and we got here and, and, and here we are, <sighs> just us and the ducks. Oh, let's get some breakfast. Oh. Wow. What are you doing? Yeah? Try it? Sure. <laughs> Do it up. You gonna fall in? You're gone. See you later forever. <laughs> Good job. Come here, let me brush you off. Oh my gosh. You still got a terrible knucklehead. <laughs> What's up guys? We just arrived to the Big Bear Alpine Zoo. I'm not quite sure what we're gonna experience, but uh, it was very highly rated on TripAdvisor, so let's go check it out. Wow. Still a gorgeous creature. <laughs> Does he store food in them? Like... Why are they so prominent? They're uh, bathing deposits. Okay. Um, and they're actually for attracting females. No way. So they dig a chubby guy. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Ethan should have been a red tegu. <laughs> Living in a giant loaf of bread. Ah, that's insane. Wow. Look how many there are in there. The thing's packed. First stop, right out of the box, the kestrel. The littlest bird of prey. So small and cute, but he's got a mouse in his claws as we speak. Oh, sick. Or talons, I guess you call them. That mouse has got the biggest balls. Proportionally on an animal that I've ever seen. Can you get a zoom in of those? Oh, and the Kestrel's only got one eye. I guess that's why he's hanging out here at the rehabilitation center. I think I can see, like... There goes a the poop. Yeah. How do you speak to these guys? Like, do you click? You don't know how to do it? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hi, lady. Oh. He's not responding. It's probably a regional dialect. Oh, this handsome devil. I think all of these animals, as soon as we step up to the fence, 
are turning their heads. This one seems interested. What about a heat map? You want to just say hi? Okay. Ew. Was that your fart? Holy shit. It was the animals. She couldn't care less. Fuck these animals, man. Did I ever tell you the story about how I lost my finger? Sticking it where it didn't belong. Oh. 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 Oh, you got some dirt. Dang. Oh, a big piece of meat. Oh, did you see the moss? It's a rat. Oh, no. It's a rat. Is it inside? Oh, it's outside. It's outside, it's outside the enclosure. And he's getting fed by that guy. It's like, oh, no way. He's getting the food underneath the water. Or the, the, the water. The gate. You can see he dug a little trench. Yeah. And he was put there for the mouse. Maybe he's trying to bait the mouse so he can eat that. Oh, and here's a gray fox. Oh, he's cute. Oh, there's a few of them. There's two or three. Don't touch it. I know you want to. Oh, look at him drink. He's so, oh, he's chewing ice. Yeah. How cute. Oh, and he just shot for us. Yeah, we see a wolf poo. Yeah, we saw a wolf poo. How many people could say they've seen that in their lives? Squeak for the camera. Oh, wow. Thank you. That was gorgeous. Oh, look at them. They're so sweet. <laughs> he looks like a grumpy guy. What's up, bud? I almost missed you there. You look... Like everything else on the ground. Here's my spirit animal. The striped skunk. Where are you, buddy? I need to make that connection with you. Meh. I mean, I don't want to wake a skunk out of a deep sleep. You know how that goes. <laughs> oh, wow. That fucker is menacing. Oh, wow. Look at that belly. That would have been the highlight poop of the day, let me tell you. <laughs> but they are intently still at the Probably all the other animals. <laughs> yeah, that must be torture for them to be surrounded by all of their snacks, their favorite snacks. Look at how close Jessica got. These are massive animals. This guy's gotta be at least 200 pounds. So we just finished up at the Big Bear Alpine Zoo. I wasn't sure what to expect, but I was pleasantly surprised. Lots of one-eyed animals and gimp-footed mammals. Um, doing some good work out here, guys. If you want to maybe support the operation or donation, check them out online. Just search for the Big Bear Alpine Zoo at Moonridge. What do you think, Jess? I think it was great. Did you have a highlight, something you liked especially? I think the timber wolf pooping was mine. Yeah, that was a good one. Saw lots of animals pooping. Yeah. Which is why anybody really goes to a zoo. Hey, stinkers, Jesse here. Uh, it's, right now you're going to be following me uh, on the slide, the bobsled slide in Big Bear. So come on, let's go.
thought I was flying solo on this, but Sean manned up and he went with me. <laughs> so we raced, I lost. It's all good. It was fun. So what'd you think? I liked it. I'm glad you convinced me to go after all. <laughs> Did you feel like we were on the cool run-ins trek? Yeah, if they decide to remake that movie with an all-female cast, you're a shoe-in. Awesome. So we got a hot tip from a local that the Teddy Bear Cafe is where it's at. Uh, free refills on coffee. I'm already smiling. Armrest on the windowsill at the perfect level. You've already earned your tip. We'll see how the food goes. What do you mean you never heard of chicken fried steak before? I don't know. Is it like a schnitzel? You come to an all-day breakfast cafe in the mountains, you gotta get chicken fried steak and gravy. But is it chicken? No, it's fried like chicken. It's beef. But why steak. is... Why is chicken in the title? Because it's fried like fried chicken. It's ridiculous. It's a schnitzel. Beef schnitzel. Schnitzel steak. It's false advertisement. We'll, we'll see when it comes out. I'll give you a bite. Okay. Here you go, Jess. Your first introduction to chicken fried country steak. You got that good white gravy, crispy chicken, bread and steak inside, eggs on the side, potatoes are brand. You ready? All right. Oh, here's a cinnamon cornbread. Oh, wow. It really is steak inside. Thank you so much. Thank you. Try it alongside your maple glazed bacon. It's okay. It's okay. very, it has very greasy, like, I don't know. Turn it off. So how is it? Well, <clears throat> I don't think I could have put anything dirtier into my body than that chicken fried steak. Uh, but the real winner of this meal, outside of this absolutely perfect windowsill armrest, is probably the cinnamon cornbread. It's the perfect sweet compliment to this otherwise incredibly high sodium meal. What do you think about yours? Oh, well. I'm, I'm sorry you didn't like it. We can send it back. All right, you ready to carry me home? <laughs> 